How dare you come to my office and attempt to bribe me? You see, the people that sent me are very powerful people. And I'm just following their orders. You call yourself a man of the law, and yet you betray the ethics of the law? A man who has no values, who fought for anything. Go and tell those your so-called powerful people that I, Adams, will not use my legitimate business to front for their dirty business. Now, out of my office. Out, I said! Damn you! How dare he? How dare he refuse my proposal? Ha! Adams! When did he come? When did he come? Adams trying to rush on this thing. Oh no! Oh! No, 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 no! Adams doesn't deserve to leave. He must die! Honorable, listen to me and listen to me carefully. Killing Adams is not the right thing to do. I mean, we can use a different method to bring him to the table. This is an apartment whose steps are simple, too clean to even bright. I don't know. The inevitable must be done! Must carry out this operation by yourself, together with your trusted ones. Hear me? As you wish, honorable. But it must be done right. Right thing must be done. What is it this time? What have I done? No, don't be silly. You irritate me whenever you speak because you speak nonsense all the time. Do you think I would have loved having a son like you? Not in this world, not even in the next world. Over my dead body. Yes, you call yourself a son of a dragon. Meanwhile, you are as venerable as a she goat. You disgust me. Dad, why are you saying these things? Why are you using such words against your own son? I, I think you begin to lose it. Lose it? Yes! And if you think you can't tolerate it, what do you do next? Hit me! Come on! Hit me if you're a man! Hit me! You are just a chicken. A little chicken ready to be prey on by a hungry hawk. All you know how to do is to eat, sleep, talk nonsense, and wear silly ties like this. Dad, I'm beginning to lose it. I'm losing it. Losing what? What are you waiting for? Your mates are out there paving way for their fathers to win the presidency and here you are. What can you post up? What is your worth? I'm gonna prove my worth to you and more. Hey! Oh boy! <laughs> That's my son. You are a real man. <laughs> yes! <laughs> you have actually shown that you've got the ability and strength. In fact, I now believe that you have the strength beyond my expectations. <laughs> this means you are ready to fight anyone who stands in my way to win the presidency come 7 December. My boy. <laughs> my boy. <laughs> now I know you are the real son of the dragon. <laughs> the true son. Of the dragon, my boy. Well done. 
I don't know, I'm not happy at all. I'm not happy at all. The future is bleak. Oh. Hello, Dad. Honorable. Those small birds will be here next. Honorable Bambu. Yes, honorable. So, what are you doing about retrieving that document from that young man? Oh, relax. Take it easy. My boys are working on it. No, you are being slow. That boy is a renowned investigative journalist working for a very popular newspaper. He has in his possession documents with evidence that seek to implicate us. That will mean our downfall. Tiger! Tiger! Yes, boss! Come here. Now, do you remember that journalist I spoke to you about? Yes, I want you to find him and collect those documents. You know what to do. Yes, Go and get him. Go! Yes. Remember that this guy has evidence against us. When we were changing our currency from the old ones to the new ones, we made millions of monies. And he also has evidence against us for inciting post-election violence during the last general elections. We need to get him. Like this. What is the problem? What is the problem? I am your mother. Please confine in me. What is the problem? Big sis, please tell us what is eating you up. Will you take that camera off my face, please? Oh my goodness. Joe, what, what are you doing here with the camera? You should be consoling your sister by now. What are you doing? It's okay, Rita. Please tell me. Tell me. Tell me what the problem is, please. Please. Dad has given me out as a sacrificial lamb to that guy Clovis. He's proud and a bully and everybody on campus despises his arrogance. I, I, I understand you. But I believe your father has your best interests at heart. He wants the best for you. Hmm? Clovis is the only son of Honorable Musabamba. But I, I believe with time, you will go to like him. Okay? Please. You mean psycho human analysis. This emotional breakdown 
explains the theory of uncertain factors of fears that tends to make we human inhibit element of fear even before we confront them joe like seriously yeah like, like seriously. really yeah joe get out get out with the camera i said I out no Not again. Huh? When are we going to have a sound sleep in this house without your constant nightmare? Huh? I'm so sorry. It's just that I It's just that what? It's just that they treat you again in your dream. If they treat you, treat them back. If they put you, put you them back. Huh? Listen to me, my friend. We are living from heart to mouth. And you are this your dream will not help us in this house. Huh? Mm. But you will not understand. No one will understand until I make them pay. Oh, are you are you the judge of the dreamer? I better go back and sleep. She's in the house. Men, I don't want you to be a pawn in a chess play. Things won't work between the two of us. Why? Can you please keep your distance away from me, please? I may not have them on silver and gold to present to you, but my heart source of beat can only be found in yours. You don't get it. See, the complications around me right now is much stronger than any bond of love well, you can ever feel for me. I really do love you. You know what? I've been betrothed to someone else. Things want to work. Please, just, just, just go, go. Don't you ever come back to me again, please. I'm very sorry. Okay. 
What do I do now? I don't know. Just walk away. Go. It's not like I don't feel anything for you. I'm a half man right here. I've given it to you all my heart. There's no left. I have a wish I could turn things right, but I don't have any choice. Please try and understand me, okay? It's not my fault either. Going back to London again for shopping. As soon as next summer holidays. Wow. You too must not put on that prank you put on <sighs> Mr. Wellington the last time you were in London. Oh, mom, come on. Our psychoanalysis eventually turned out to be true. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. And that almost wrecked the business deal I have with him, too. <laughs> okay, Dad, listen. We promise to be on our best behavior. Papers are ours, right? Oh, yeah, you do. All right, all right. I'll take you two to our new building sites next weekend. Wow! That's <laughs> awesome! I know you're gonna like that. Yeah, at least get out of this mansion for once. Come on. What do you mean this mansion? Oh yeah, mom, of course it's a prison. Oh my goodness. Wait till you start by yourself. I know. <laughs> Farida, are you okay? Since when did you start growing wings? How do you expect me to be okay when you keep on tormenting my life, making my life a living hell? Zuku! What did you just say? One more word from me will lie in the to Allah. Farida, I'll chop off your head and feed it to the vultures. Where were you when I was fighting for you and your family during the uprising? Do you expect me to be silent? Whilst you take away the only joy that I have, it's almost like letting me die while you rescue me and my family. I hate to say this, but I have to. I don't love you! Shazia! Have you forgotten who you're talking to? Don't be ungrateful, Farida. Give me that love, or else my conscience will feel no remorse if I take it by force. Bafira! Hello, baby. I'm in a business meeting right now. Let me just call you back as soon as possible. Come on, sweetheart. Don't talk like that. You know you're my only queen, Rita. Come on now. Okay. I promise I'll come see you soon. Love you. Bye. What? I thought you said 
said I'm all you ever wanted. And I just gave you my virginity. Sometimes a man says something just to get him what he wants. So you used me? Don't talk about that. All right? Let me sign a check for you. And that's because I'm generous. I'm a gentleman. Okay? I'll sign a check. What's your name again? Oh, I just remembered. All right. A check for about... 10,000? Yeah? 10,000 Ghana C's, all for you. Here you go. Try not to get in touch with me again, okay? God will punish you. God will punish you. Oh, well, my dear, whatever I wanted God will punish you, you. I already got. After me giving you my virginity, you are dumping me like a rug. No, I'm not dumping. <laughs> Leave me alone. I will call you when I need you again. I'll call you back once I need Leave you. Leave me alone. Make sure you don't leave anything, okay? Go to punish you. Go to punish you. Yeah. What is wrong with you, Rita? What is wrong with you? The most eligible bachelor on campus is crazy about you. He's handsome, rich, popular, and most of all, powerful. And just would do anything at your command. <laughs> Rita, tell me, what else do you want from me? You see, that's the thing. The measure of a real man is not how he looks like or what he has in his possession. It's 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 more than that. You know, it's 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 actually what lies deep within him. Yeah. What exactly are you driving at? Well, I mean, Clovis is a really nice guy and I, I really like him, but I think all the negative things I hear about him on a daily basis is just driving my affections for him away. Yeah, and besides, I don't want to be one of his conquests. <laughs> Whoa. Insecurity is the Best sign of a woman in love. Excuse me. No, 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 no. See, that's, I'm, I'm not insecure. Yes, I'm far from no. Insecurity is not, it's not a part of me. I'm not insecure. I just, I just don't wanna, you know. I don't, I don't wanna be one of this. Well, closest. I mean, every woman's dream. <sighs> Linda. Did you hear anything I just said? Oh, 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 I did, you know, I did, I did, I, I heard, I did. So Chloe says, why don't you go for him? Oh, no, 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 he decides to unleash his anger on my dear sister one day, right? Yeah, well, I understand why all of you are doing that. But you know your father stands on his words. For reasons best known to him, he's already taken his decision that Glovis takes you as his bride. See, that's the thing, Molly. I don't even foresee any happiness with Clovis. I might end up being his punching bag or something. Yes, it's true. Besides, Mom, you know we are in the 21st century. My dear sister has the right to marry any guy of her choice. Yeah. Who do you know about marriage?
Good Lord. 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 I will not let you bully me again. You are sucking, drinking this Gary as if you are drinking original ice <laughs> Come on here. When you come for food, you gonna grow horns, become like macho man. I mean, the tiger. And why you tell you make your work now? You will tell me, say, volcanic eruption don't land for your head. Your stomach gonna some assault as if, say, don't make me vest now. Hey, this job, say. listen, this job, what would they do? But they do as small, small, they manage the job until we get a better job to do. I know, yeah, I know, say you, they, they help me do some job, but if, if, that doesn't mean you you stab me in this house. Anyway, it's high time we will we look for another job aside this liberal job. We will hardly, you know, get our, 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 our daily food from this job. Hunger is finally making man out of my brain. Not the best. What's in the world? Don't give us food. Make it talk sensible things for once. Eh? Men. <coughs> me, I, me, I they go out. Uh, I they go see mm. my, my, meet my friend. I Men. go see whether you, you bail me out from this crazy hunger. If you like, enter that home. I'm going to turn up for you that place. I they, go. I they follow you, go to. Ah! And I'm going back. The way me want on the floor, it a go low. He want me waist like this snake, it a go so. The way me want him see boy, it a kill him so. Him look up at me face and he want me to go. Hey, 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 hey. I won't tolerate your excesses any longer, okay? Clovis, I'm your girlfriend and you must accord me the necessary respect. What's eating you up? Well, I am being tagged as a lover of a bully in this city. And I can't go anywhere without people trying to keep their distances away from me. Oh, that? <laughs> oh, you think it's funny? <laughs> Listen, that is the mark of the highest order you can ever get, okay? Fear, you mean. Clovis, just stop bullying people, okay? I'm a simple girl and I just want to live a simple life. Oh, no, 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 you're not a simple girl. You are the daughter of the most powerful politician in this country. Now, you get, need to get used to that, my darling, okay? Look, it's not funny. Just stop bullying people. Rita? Tell the security patrol, and I know they'll find her. 
Go for it. Nice. Due to psychoanalysis, something tells me my sister is going to wake up. So relax, okay? Take my leave now. Please. No, 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 stay, stay. Let me, let me introduce oh, you to my parents. The most important thing is you're back home safely. I have to leave, please. No, no, please. no, please come oh, in. Please, please. Let me... No, let's go. No, 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 Divine intervention of a good Samaritan. I would have been raped and probably murdered in cold blood. Oh my God. Yes, the taxi driver I picked could have been a serial killer or or a rapist. What? Yeah. And, 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 and where is the good Samaritan? At least we can we can reward him. Well, as soon as he brought me to the gate, he just left. He refused to be compensated and just left. Are you okay? Good Samaritan in this country? Yeah. No, this must be the handiwork of my enemies. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to increase the security details around you and your brother Joe. Oh. That's what I will do. Thank you. What? Thank you. Thank you sure you are right? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. I never had any intention to collect anything from her. I saved her and that is it. It happened. It can happen to anybody. Okay? So it wasn't my intention to even collect money from her. That is it. You know, say we day poor. Even when God brings opportunity in our way. You, you, if you dare, you go do good Samaritan. <laughs> can you imagine? Man, no. I understand what we are going through. But let me tell you, everything will be well. Yeah, for we'll a very short time, all these things will soon be over. We'll and also, when God wants to bless us, He will bless us in, in His own time. Don't be said because I have person, I will go there rich. No. God don't teach us that kind of thing for Bible. Thanks. I just don't understand why my daughter is going through Woman, all this. Stop disturbing me about this issue. Honey, isn't it obvious that Clovis is not the best choice for our daughter? And can't you see they don't match? Listen, his father is my best friend and I'll give him my word. Look, his careless life will end up ruining our daughter's future. I hope you don't regret this someday. I hope you don't. Listen. Because she doesn't listen deserve to me. She... I don't want to talk about this anymore. Come on. Honey, you can't do this. For break. Yes. yes. <laughs> break for now. I'm going to the other side. Okay, sir. Okay. Don't keep long. All right. Okay.
You don't know this music. This is my favorite prank from Kanye. So hey! What aren't nonsense? So, I pay your foreman a whole lot of money to get this job done on time, and you foolishly dance in here. Honorable, I'm really sorry. Sorry? I went to the other side to check on the workers. This will not happen again. So, sorry, sir. So sorry, so sorry, sir. Hey, you, you fine. Oh. Okay. No, 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 no. Um, Dad, you can't fire him. I mean, sometimes I think a little play at work helps in the greater output of the workforce. Yeah, I, I think you should commend them for their efforts. Right, Joe? <laughs> no, you, you, you are right. It's another advanced touch of human dispensational emotional catalyst that, that breathes out the excitement to enhance general output. Yeah, she's right. You should count your stars that my daughter interceded for you. Thank you or sir. else. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. And you, what's your name? Wait. So you're Ikechi? Do you two know each other? No, 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 sir. Take the name, sir. Take this one, madam. Go, go. Farida, what is it? You defiled me. Took away my pride. I assure you. Posterity will judge you. Do one fresca. Sha, sha, sha. I took what is rightfully mine. I was never yours and I will never be. Your... You can only have my body. Not my soul. For your information, you are at my beck and call. Masiachi. She wants you to grant her an interview for a school project. I expect you to give your maximum cooperation. Do you understand? Thank you, I understand. I can. Please don't forget the situation at home. Ah. Hope you yeah. understand. <laughs> anyway. Hey, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. And how is your family? They're good, everybody's fine. Um, what can I do for you? And why is it video on us? Joe, please excuse us. 
you mean I should stop recording? And how do we analyze the hypothesis of his speech to come to a concluding factor? Joe, I said, excuse me. Fa Joe, okay. leave. All right, all right, all right. Joe. Perfect. So, uh, forgive my little brother. He's nosy like that. No problem, no problem. Then, I understand. Uh, but what, I am just a common leverer. What, what good can I be to you? Well, I was actually... I want to... I'm not going anymore. I have other plans. Other plans? What relevance is that to our date? Look, tell me, what is going on here? Well, I have a very important meeting. And stop commanding me like I'm your slave. Well, you will be my wife soon, and I demand respect now! Well, then wait till I become your wife. Excuse me. Rita, come back here. Rita, come back here! Come back here! Okay. Why are you not drinking? Oh. Good. Tell me, Rita, why are you being nice to me? You are from the elite world where my presence can barely be recognized in the society. On the contrary, I believe very much in your presence. And I want to record and study your like. Now, just a piece of guinea pig in the laboratory, right? No, far from that. I want to get to know you better. That's the thing. And you keep recording our conversation. Well, I guess you, that's the only way I can keep track with our progress. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And let me ask you this. Why did you not want me to reveal your good Samaritan <laughs> nature to my dad? <laughs> you could have been heavily rewarded, you know. The rich always think they can buy the conscious or the good nature of a man. But that's not what it looks like. Ikechi, it's just a matter of showing appreciation, that's all. Look, it's in my nature to do good to people. And it's in our nature just to show gratitude. Come on. There's nothing wrong with that. And there's nothing wrong with paying you back with being nice. That means you're paying me for my good deeds, which is wrong. Well, that's showing appreciation. Hey, Rita, please talk to me. Why are you looking sad and so moody? Look, has, has your dad harmed you in any way? Or is it Clovis? It's you, How? Why are you repeating a little gift I'm offering you? Why is it that the rich always think they can buy the mind of the poor with money? Do you actually think I'm trying to buy your love? Oh, come on. So I'm trying to buy your mind. It's been a very long time since we ate a meal like this. Oh. <laughs> You're still very welcome. Mm. Don't worry, soon everything will be better. By the way, when is this interview going to come to an end? 
See, I'm beginning to. Okay, it's okay. So, my madam, don't mind him. Let the interview continue as long as you want it. Amen. Mm. Because you're not the one being interviewed, right? Right, the same. <laughs> so funny. So, are you uncomfortable? Well, just that the way the whole thing is going, you know. Being a case study, interviewing me, recording our conversation. I don't know. Are you studying psychology? <laughs> Don't worry, soon it'll be all over, I promise. I just can't wait. Just can't wait. Why are you staring at me? I'm just happy that you're enjoying your food. <laughs> Cheers, anyway. Cheers. Cheers, Mama. This is what I've been complaining about. She tells me nothing. She just disappears. I don't know where she is. I Calm down. Calm down, my boy. Let me take it from here. I think I've warned you about boys going around trying to ruin my name. Get it this very moment. But, Dad... No, but! Get it before I lose my temper. Well, honorable. I am aware of the boys, and uh, I want to guarantee that me and my team, we will fish them out and deal with them. I can promise you that. Thank you very much. Please. I want to leave now. That's good. Thank you. All right. Take care of yourself. Thank you. Clovis, 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 my HNIC. Come on, man. I've never seen you like this before. What's sweeping you off your feet? Talk, man. <laughs> what I'm going through, none of you can help me out. What? Practically no one can help you out? Let it out, and we will deal with that fellow. <sighs> Rita, this chick is driving me nuts! Who the hell is she to disrespect me like that? <laughs> Come on, man. It's obvious you are in love with her. We all know. Yeah. But what is, I'm so surprised. Why can't she fall for your charm like other girls do? Because she's a different girl. What's so much? You know we got your mark 24-7. <laughs> you know, we run things in our own way. Nobody tell us to do. Chill out, man. Do what you yeah? Honorable, oh, please calm down. Everything is under control. There's nothing to Rita said all those nasty things about me. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, who the hell is this laborer guy anyway? Who the hell is he? Look, I'm gonna breathe so much fire on him. He has no idea what's coming his way. Calm down, handsome. Rita isn't worth all this sweat. I mean, what is it that she has that I don't have? I'm willing to warm your bed anytime and be your baby. Look. Rita is a woman that any man wants, and I want her. Yet you find solace in my bosom, constantly mourning out in the heat of passion. What do you want from me? 
Huh? I've given you everything you ever ask. What do you want from me? Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out! I don't care what becomes of me. I have greater plans with Big Kitchi. And I love him. That's what that matters. Rita, he's a common laborer for crying out loud. Clovis has it all. In this lender, very soon, Ikechi will be a, a student of this school. And then you realize how serious I am with him. Now I've seen you've totally lost it. Clovis is not only going to kill you, but kill that poor guy. And I don't care. I don't care about Clovis. I don't care what he can do. I don't love him. Linda, I don't love him. And that's final. Final? Yeah. Previously on Homeland. I'd like you to meet my head of security, Carrie Mack. It's like I see. Us. What up, man? You, me, some additional security. Yeah. Additional security nice if we take to conferences in Japan. I've got Japan. something that's that works more than what do you want. What I'm doing is planning a visit later this week. He can't go there safely without wearing the tape. Who is this? The guy distracting your girl, of course. Is this the dude? Mm-hmm. Is this the guy trying to ruin my relationship with Rita? Trust me. Really? Look at him. Come on, H and I see. You know my formations are always on point. I fished him up. And even all his hangout. That's him. Yo, Clovis, why are we wasting so much time on this guy? Let's go get him and wake him up. Just like that. I couldn't have agreed on anything better than this solution. But I alone can handle this guy. Really? I have a plan. Everything is under control. The autopsy was conducted and our doctor gave the required result, annulling any form of suspicion. Case dead. No hey. witness. Wow! Brilliant! Oh! This calls for a celebration. Honorable, what do you think? I agree with you. Ah. Inspector, Honorable. please pass by my office tomorrow for a parcel. This case almost broke my result. at the age and the generation we are in right now, I think it's about time that we begin to hire smart, intelligent, and swift guys who can distribute the stuff properly. So, if I had a son like Clovis, I bet I'd be the president by now. <laughs> also, Recruiting intelligent undergraduates with their smart computer mind. That can make us break through any security agency. Great. Great! <laughs> of course. Awesome. You see, Clovis, that's why I sent you to that university so that you can acquire a higher level of intelligence. Now, whatever you will need to recruit those boys, you know, whatever money, just go to the bank, withdraw something Quite sufficient enough to recruit them. Okay? That's all I needed to hear. Good. Good. Ah, that's those two hours victory. Hey, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh wait. No, no, no. To our friendship.
Rita, come with me now. Rita, I command you to come with me now. I said no. Dare you disobey me? Come here. Come here. Come here. life unnecessarily hard for me. You know, I'm a big girl and I can be friends with whoever I decide to be friends with. Look, Rita, if I may say, why don't us just stop this? I wouldn't want you to lose all the good things in life just because you want to be with me. Rita, are you crazy? Look, you're my best friend and meeting you has opened my heart to an entirely different world. So, I want to know more about you. Tell me about your, your upbringing, who you are. Tell me about your parents. Where are your parents? Rita, I had such a wonderful family. Um, Gloria. Yes, Dad. You're going to school tomorrow. Yes. You are Gloria Adams. And Adams. And as I always say, that the name goes with respect and integrity. So I want you to go to school and maintain that respect and integrity. Ah, Daddy. You know I'm a good girl and I've always been a good girl. Ah, no, I know. Oh, that so, Dad, ah. it's high time you believe in your daughter. Ah. Tell me, how many times has somebody come here to complain that she has done one or two ah. things? Oh, come idea. on, Dad. Ah. And Mom, you're just keeping quiet. Ah. <laughs> you oh, come oh, on. Huh? Yes, she is. But your daddy is advising her. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's all. I hear. That's all. I'll be back. And you, Gloria, I've packed your things. Good Samaritan. Make sure you do not give them out to your friends and come back home here. Hmm? Okay. <laughs> Good <girl>. Samaritan. <laughs> <laughs> Frank, how did you get to know my house? What do you want? <laughs> why, why are you doing this? Money. Temptation of money can make a man of the law lawless. And you have stepped on the toes of the mighty. Your cup is full. Please. Come on, get up, please. Come on. What are you? What are you? Get up. Please don't kill my child. Help me. Come on. <laughs> You said like remembering it. They were so loving and caring. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I didn't know what to do. I missed them so much. So much. Thank you for coming to my life, Thank you so much. I love you. 
Cause I never knew, I never thought that love comes in different ways. Everything I know is not the same. The rich for the rich and the poor for the poor used to be my mindset. Now I know how wrong I was. I just wanna be right, cause this feeling is so right. I am blown away. I am blown away. The day is bright. right I'm feeling on top of the sky the sky the sky The rich for the rich and the poor for the poor it used to be my mindset. Now I know how wrong I was. I just wanna be right, cause this feeling is so right. Remember that's it taking us to London. Sis. Big sis. Why? What is wrong with you? You are in love with that inkage boy, the Libra, dear sis. Follow the power of the will within and never back out of what you believe in. I'm in a web of the high MIT. Now how do I break free? Persistence and will always wins. Yeah. Always wins. Yeah. Yeah. I've got your back. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I've got your back, okay? And you owe me one. Let me check on mom, okay? And make sure you're crying no more. Thank you. Love you. Love you too. Make sure you're crying. My friend. Menu, menu. How good to go? Yeah, she don't go. How she don't go. Well, mm. all is well. My all friend, is well. let me tell you something. Mm. Are you this stupid? Huh? Can't 
you say they are in love with you? Now, reason why they insult me like that? Me and they insult you. I did tell you the truth. The thing where you play, you play it. Look, make I tell you, nobody say anything. But how you believe say nice girl like this will get better shit? Go just fall in love with common laborer like me. <laughs> that one I dream with a dream, my friend. The inferiority complex <laughs> will kill you one day. Ah, just be a man and she will open her true love to you. Okay. I mean, uh, be because I day here, if I won't get a new girl what I want, I know so I go try my best. But no be this one, this one, this one too. Oh, this one past my level now. You know, past oh. your level. She fit change your level. I haven't seen him for the past two days now. Stop lying! I'm not lying. I haven't seen him for the past two days. Now listen to me. Tell him. Dragons and humans don't sit on the same table. Okay? And if I see him around Rita again, I will. He's already here. Mother, please. I just want to be left alone. I don't want to see him. Tell me now and make you snap. Um, you said the problem. Very good. I, I, I know I don't talk like this often. But you're beautiful. And it takes a man in his right senses to fathom that beauty. See, you just said it. It takes a man in his right senses to acknowledge the beauty that emanates from him. Yeah. 
I said it. <laughs> I know. Sometimes love cherished and adored by old heads cannot be compared to the fantasies of considered emotions. I just want to talk about love you. Clovis, I just want you to change. I'm a changed man! <laughs> look at me! Hey! Look! I know sometimes I behave mean, but I'm really a gentleman. Really gentle. And from this moment onwards, I'm changed. Totally. I'm a new guy. Changed. And I want to lay emphasis on that constant that I love you.
the great king, Zarki Zango. Bring on Manu. That's my king. Bring on Manu. If a commoner decides to eat the king's meat, he must be prepared to live up to it. According to the customs of my kingdom, Manu must face me, man to man. I crave your indulgence. I will fight on his behalf to gain his freedom. As he wish. No! Hide it. Fight in the public and let the rams fight a spiritual battle. God, bring the rams.
I have never ever lost a fight in my own yard. Left alone, two fights. Well, Highness, you have earned my respect. Come here. Thank you, Your Highness. Get up! know I gave you this information. You can be making love for the very first time. Labor. Who runs this city? That's what I'm talking about. Yeah! Anything happens to Kichi, I will kill you myself. I just, I just, I just love it when you get so wild. It's, it makes me so attracted to you. Don't you get it? I don't love you. I would never love you, and you can never have my buddy. Never. Well, I'm here to take what is rightfully mine. And I see. Is that you? And then you go and give yourself to that stupid boy when I'm here. Huh? Come on, come on. Stay the hell away from me. What's going to happen? 
You're gonna stab me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna stab me. Taking him to the private chamber. Yes, boss.
This is sure miracle. Sure miracle, and I think she will be fine by his grace. Okay, honorable. She will be fine. Let's go. Doctor, yes, thank sir. you so very much. I'll pay you anything there is to make sure my daughter gets better. That's okay. That's okay. Let's just pray she gets better. That's the most important. I don't know, it's just, the good thing is, she's still in the hospital and she's been in coma since, so she hasn't spoken. I don't know what to do. Clovis, Rita must die. Yeah, but, I, yes, she, she must die. And you must get someone very capable to take care of the situation. You know, our survival depends on this. Rita must die.
under arrest. Come here right now. What is happening? Where? Campus? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm on my way coming. I'm on my way coming. Hello? Clovis is in trouble. A really big trouble, sir. I can't explain that. They might kill him. I'm on my way coming. Hello? Hello? Hello?